Another really important idea for the tactile pleasure of her work is that fiber artists very specifically describe the pleasure of having the material in the hand, that it's soothing and hypnotic and repetitive to pull the thread, to touch the fabric. It's a, almost like a mantra. It can be meditative. It's tactile. It's soothing. And I think she really derived that pleasure. And you see it almost every... Um, I'm going to cut ahead on the creative growth stuff to get to... There's Joyce and Judith as twin sisters. So look at these, right? Are those... Are those... The, are those they? I don't know. You know, we don't know. But we can make that assumption, perhaps. So this is Judith making her very first piece. Um, it's the only piece she painted. She wrapped this wood, and uh, then she painted it. Stan, who you saw in the film, was so surprised that she was doing this that he actually had a camera and said, oh, we're going to take a picture of this. <laughs> we're, ne we're never going to see this again. Yeah, but from the moment she did this first one until you know, her death, she didn't stop to the point where her fingers were bleeding and she wanted them to be bandaged. So clearly there was something about the contact and the touch that was a compelling part of what she did. This is how our piece went together. Everything is manual. It's, she's acquiring objects, which I think responds to her life in an institution where there's no privacy, there's no personal objects, everything is subject to search and seizure. So she'd take things and acquire them. That's the art term, I think she'd steal them. And <laughs> start, start to build them, and sort of build these armatures for them over a period of time. Now, it's also interesting to notice these very early photographs of Judith, you see her without the head wraps and the hats. And as she became more developed in her work, what she wore on her head became more and more elaborate. Here's a piece made out of paper towels. So if you want to talk about a tactile engagement with an object, this is a hundred trips to the bathroom. <laughs> right? That's not, while her work has a lot of conceptual appeal, the manufacturing of it, the process of it, is very much a hands-on experience. 